I told y'all don't hold me to no no vlogging because I'll be in my feelings, my emotions. I'll go talk to God, um, talk to my inner circle. And then here I am back again. So guess who's back? Back again. Tina's back. Tell a friend. But my lips are still swollen and like, I don't know what happened to my face. I've had like all type of reactions because my lips are still swollen as you can see. They're swollen really bad. Oh my goodness. And then my eye, like I have a lazy eye. This is my lazy eye. So if you didn't know, now you know. And it's been so evident the past couple like week because um, I've been getting sleep, but it's not real good sleep. So you can really see my lazy eye. Like it's really showing out. Like sometimes you can't notice it. And it's just been really bad lately. Like in the hair pulls my face down so it's like you can see the lazy eye really bad because I do have a lazy eye so yeah I, I have a lazy eye yeah so um anyway uh dropped the little kids off Christian's water bottle broke yesterday so he needs a new one so before I take Justin to school, because it is only 7.30, I want to go get Christian a new one from the H-E-B, but the line to get out of the school is ridiculous per usual. Like, the line is just ridiculous. They need to do something about this, because taking parents 30, 40 minutes just to get out, it, it's too much. It's too much, especially if you got to go home and get your middle schooler and bring your middle schooler in. It's like you drop off the elementary to go pick up the middle schooler, but how are you going to drop off the middle schooler you know, with all this hour worth of traffic, it, it makes no sense. So, I don't know. So, I'm at Pflugerville Nutrition. I haven't been here since my brother died. So, I don't know. I like, I feel a little nervous to go in. Because um, I feel like getting my life back to normal is like disrespecting him. But I know that he wouldn't want us to stay stagnant. I know he wouldn't want us to live in June 22nd. I know he wouldn't want that. So this is a big step for me to go into here. Like, y'all just don't understand. This is a huge step for me in my healing process. And they don't even know it. But me going in here it's a huge step, so let's go, guys. Let's, I'm taking y'all with me in one of my first steps to normalcy. Um, going back into a place that I used to go to almost daily. All right, guys, I did it! I went and she's so nice. I just love the people at Pflugerville Nutrition. They're so sweet. So if y'all get a chance, you live in the Austin area or visit the Austin area, come here. Oh, this is good. This is a maple pecan cheesecake. Mm -mm -mm. It's so good. It only has 250 calories and it has like 20 grams of protein or something like that. <clears throat> mm -mm -mm. And I got the Thanos. It's an energy drink. Well, no, this is Captain America. <clears throat> and it's an energy drink. And it's low calorie as well. So I got that for after the gym so I can get my energy back up. I really want to become the old me. Um, I read the Bible verse yesterday. Um, it was Isaiah. I hope this is right. Isaiah 55, 11. <coughs> and basically, um, just to recap it, because I don't have like a Bible in my car, which I should. I don't know why I don't. But um, just putting it in plain English is basically when you say something, you're not just saying it. Like when you say, I'm going to lose weight, you're not just saying, I'm going to lose weight and then it falls on death. You know, when you say, I'm going to lose weight, you're going to do it. You're going to accomplish anything that you set out that you say that you're going to do. It is going to come to pass. It's going to come to existence. So I said, I am going to be healed. 
I am going to cope with the loss of my brother. And I'm going to remember good times. And I'm going to remember happy times. And I'm going to let everybody know about him. And it ain't going to fall on deaf ears. It's action behind it. And it's going to be accomplished and it's going to be done. So this was a big first step to that. Just this drink right here. So I'm happy to be back. slowly but surely i'm going to be back and hopefully my eye will get back on track this lazy eye is acting a fool never been able to really detect my lazy eye like i've been able to detect it this past week i wonder if i had something happen to me or something when i was asleep because my lips swollen from the allergic reaction now my lazy eye is lazy lazy i wonder if something happened to me when i was asleep i don't, I don't know but um let me get off here at the walmart guys because i gotta pick up bagel bins because we're out of bagels i need to get some allergy medicine to help with this reaction i got this allergic reaction and try to find a, a new school cup for grace so i got one for christian so i might as well get one for grace too so they both have new ones because that's how I am. If one get one, I try to get one for the other. So we'll look for one for her here. See what we can find. Look at the baby sizes. I miss having a baby. I so miss having a baby. Look at that. The itty bitty feet sizes. Oh. Don't think about it. I ain't thinking about it. I ain't thinking about it. Trying to find this, some sandals for Grace. Um, but these are all the kid sizes, baby sizes. Where is the big girl sizes? I think this is it down here. I just want just something that she can easily just throw on that can kind of go with anything, like something like this. These would go with anything. So I think I'm gonna get these. I wanna get them a little bit big, but I don't know. The last ones I got a little bit big. Yes. I don't know. I think I'm gonna get her size. Because the last shoe I got was a little bit too big and it flopped. So I think. Let's get a three. But this will go with a lot of her outfits that she wears. Or, well, something like this. Something like this. But these are too thick. Like, they're not wide enough. She needs something wide like this. Oh, do they got a four? They do. Uh, I could get these for her. But I don't know how much to like that material. I don't know. I think I'll probably stick with the ones I got because I can wear the I can pair those with anything. These boots are cute. The sparkly boots. I like those too. Cause she can just throw them on, throw them off. They're a little heavy. Um. Oh, here goes some. And they're wide. This is something, this is what I'm talking about. Some cute, just little Mary Janes to just throw on. So yeah, I'm gonna get these for Grace. This is what I'm looking for. Just some cute throw on Mary Janes. And because of the color, it'll go with any outfit. So we'll go with this. And 
And I like these too, because they're just gray and they'll go with anything too. And they now sell Justice inside of here. So if you got kids that, little girls that like to wear Justice, they have Justice inside of Walmart now. So that is nice. Oh, here's a little boy stuff. They got Fortnite. Fortnite. Oh, I like this. For Christian. Oh, they got Minecraft. Oh, Christian, I like Minecraft. Oh, these are all cute. So I ended up getting him a Minecraft shirt. So he has a Minecraft shirt. Now let me get this medicine so I can get up out of here. They got like clearance athletic shirts going for $3. I like these. These make really nice workout shirts. So I think I'm going to grab one. Because I like this. Trying to see here. Oh, you can't go wrong with too many of the white ones. So I'm going to grab one of these ones too. Pants on sale, but no, they not. Just the shirts. All right, here we go. Allergy, allergy. So I want non-drowsy though, because I ain't trying to go to sleep. All right. And it's only, I'm gonna have, I need to get some more B12, so I'm gonna get some B12 and I need iron, but this is a two pack. I want a single. I'm not looking for it. So I'll get that one. Is this a chewable? Oh, this one's a quick dissolve chewable. Is that one a chewable? Yeah, that's a chewable too, so. And then I want to get some, but I don't need none. Oh, it's called Cotton Candy Cloud. Look at that. All right, guys, I'm back in the car. Let me turn it on real quick, because it's hot. I'm sorry, y'all, it's not about to burn me up. Injury, the Uber or Lyft. Y'all are not finna burn me up in here. Let me sanitize my hands. I'm about to go home and I'm gonna record. Um, I got I got two videos I gotta record. My weight loss video, which will be up today, so y'all already seen it by now. Um, and then a haul video for the other channel but i wanted to take my medicine really quick y'all seen everything i got out the walmart walmart be having you buying things you like well i didn't need them shirts or none but i like having like little shirts like that and stuff around i really do but let me go ahead and take this medicine so b12 I go check my mailbox or whatever. There's this coupon from Wendy's, okay? And they got something called New Big Bacon Cheddar. I'm nosy, I gotta try it. I'm about to go try it, y'all. I wanna know what that do. And look, my lip is just peeling so bad. I'm sorry, guys. Um, but you get $2 off the premium combo meal. So you'll get $2 off of it. And plus, I ain't gonna eat half of it. So to get $2 off of it is a win. And the bun is nothing but, it's like, what? The bun is a cheddar bun. So I'm gonna eat the bottom part of the bun, not the top. So we're gonna have to try this out. So let's go try it out. And then I'm going through my mail, right? And I got the in circle from Neiman Marcus because I'm a Neiman Marcus card holder. Um, and they say your points card has arrived. I'm like, what are y'all talking about? So I'm over here reading it and it says you get um, when you use your Neiman Marcus or credit card at Neiman Marcus or at last call or all the other places they have in stores online or by catalog, you score in circle points. When you accumulate 10,000 in points, we'll automatically redeem them and send you another hundred dollar points card. So I had 10,000 in points, so they went ahead and sent me a $100 card. So, wow. Wow, I could treat myself to anything and I get $100 off at Neiman Marcus. So, ooh, what do I want? I gotta check my D-Bit. I gotta, ooh, and I got a great rep at Neiman Marcus that I love. Oh my goodness. So I'm gonna look around 
Neiman Market site. I don't want to go in there because nah, I don't want to. But I'll look around the site. But I don't have to use it right now. It's good to 219 2022 So I have time. But I got $100. Wow. Points card reward. Talk about being rewarded for being faithful. Okay. $100. I got $100. Thank you, Neiman Marcus. Oh. Let me try this thing though. We'll try it together in just a minute in the car, okay? So I just placed my order and like, he was a little bit <laughs> single, double, or triple. I was like, oh, it comes in um, single, double, triple? I didn't know that. And he's all like, yeah, so what you want? I'm like, God, uh, enjoy your job a little bit. You know, have fun with it. I mean, you gotta go to work. Might as well enjoy it. You know what I mean? I don't know. Everybody don't like that, I guess. I just hate when it's not a good experience and people feel as happy as I feel. I don't know. I feel, how do y'all feel about that? When people just not feeling it, like you feeling it, you in a good mood, you feeling it. And then they just Debbie Downer. Like, I don't know. How does that make y'all feel? Let me know in the comments below. But it makes me feel like, dang, I'm all happy. And you just, yeah, whatever. Like, dang. <laughs> oh, I cannot wait to try this though. This thing. Oh my goodness, I'm excited to try this sandwich. Oh my goodness. I got my Sprite Zero mixed with peach, so peach Sprite Zero. And if you eat this whole thing, the whole small meal, you're looking at a thousand calories. Like, that's a lot. Like, thank goodness I can't eat the whole meal. I'm probably not going to get through half the meal. But yeah, this is the um burger thumbnail looks just like that um on the picture it looks so much more appealing than in person like the cheddar where's the cheddar at the bottom like seriously so of course that part comes off i wish they had the bacon situated on the other side like i want it so i'm just going to turn it over and um yeah My bad, guys. Hmm. Maybe if the bacon was crispy, it would have been better. But... It ain't all that. My fry, I'm gonna put it in the sauce and thing like that. I'm not gonna eat all my fries either. Basically, I just picked through my food. <laughs> like you tell your kids, don't be picking through that food. And then here go you. That's what you do, you pick through your food. So, same fry, just getting the, the onions and stuff. The onions and the sauce, all that slaps. So, I guess because I don't, I don't really mess with bread like that. I don't know. And I don't mess with a lot of beef hard like that, so... It tastes good to me like this, broken up. <laughs> and then they got cheese. Yeah. Um, I really didn't eat much of the bread. Didn't touch the bottom at all. In the beef pattern. I don't really mess with it. And I'm good. It's 2.33. I'm about to get out of here. But I just threw on this dress really quick. Um, yeah, I'm wearing a regular bra with it. Oh, well. I'm just going up to school to pick up the little kids and sit in the car and wait for Justin. So, But I just wanted to change into something a little flowy or whatever. And I'm going to put my earrings on in the car. And that's going to be it. 
Um, I didn't feel I need to do the strapless bra and all that extra. I'm going to be sitting and seeing some moms. I ain't worried about it. I'm just not. But these are the earrings. Oops. I'm going to throw on just from the beauty supply store. Nothing extra. But I need to get running because, oh, that fairy tale smelling good, y'all. Look, I'm burning fairy tale. Okay, it's just getting started on the warmer. It is amazing so far. I knew I was going to love her. Oh, I'm glad I looked down because these kids were through a fit. If I ain't protect the brain, the name brands. And then I gotta grab Justin's basketball because yes, basketball at four. He wants to play, so he's gonna play. These kids, y'all, these kids keep me doing 20 million thousand things, okay? in the school i got this to try out today this is isopure i think that's how you say it yeah so it has 20 grams of protein in it this joint tastes good 80 calories alpine punch is which one this is because i stopped and got justin um the body let me see body armor drink because he likes this a lot like i need to find the no calorie one though i don't like the calories in this one yeah i like he said he likes the calories <laughs> but it's 210 calories per bottle so i want to find the low calorie version he keep, keep going he keep shaking his head now <laughs> yes mm -mm. i like this you need low calorie version i don't like that one but anyway i'm gonna finish drinking this this morning um so, yeah, we'll talk. so i just left out of walmart let me turn let me turn the air down but i just left out of walmart and i had to make sure i got some edge control for my edges because my edges woo -wee, i cannot wait to get my hair done but i've been trying out like 20 different edge controls every time i get these styles i try out like 20 different edge controls and i still can't find that one for this full c like i i, I just cannot Ooh. -oh. Okay, purse, getting in the way of things. Turning airs up and things. Um, I'm trying to find my edge control brush because I bought me a little brush thing. I think this came from the Dollar Tree or something. I can't, I can't recall. But these things do not stay closed. I do not know why from Bath and Body Works. But anyway, yeah, we're gonna try this out. Like it sits good and it will sit good for like five minutes. And then next thing you know, it be back to looking like it was nothing put on it because my hair just eats products like my 4c will eat a product up like it's nothing and i'm trying to look halfway decent because i'm going out with liz it's our day for lunch and oh, i'm trying to be kind of cute semi semi somebody you know semi cute so i gotta have these. I just want to just have them sleep 
like through like that. Like I don't even want to design them or nothing. Cause first of all, I don't know how to do all that. <laughs> so I ain't even gonna cap and pretend like I know how to do hair and things. I cannot. That's why I just want it to stay like this. Like I know if I had a little scarf, you know, I could put a scarf on it and it'll help the longevity of it. But you see how good that looks? Man, this stuff works good. What is this? This is Cream of Nature with Argon Oil Perfect Edges. It said 24 hour extreme hole. Yeah, okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. You ain't met 4C like mine. Extreme hole. I don't believe it. But we'll see. Watch when I check out it. When I check in in about an hour after I get out this bath and body works doing my filming, it's going to be a mess. But this is the Calypso Light. It's five calories. So if you want something sweet and you don't want to mess with soda, diet soda, because I drink diet soda, and you don't want to mess with diet soda, five calories, no car one carb, five calories, no added sugars. Get you one of them Calypsos, okay? So, yeah. That's with that. So let me get into the Bath and Body Works to finish up with that. And then I got to go get the kids swimsuits because I got to bring them to Kenny because he's taking the kids swimming when he picks them up. If I told y'all how the day has went since yesterday afternoon, you wouldn't believe me. Like, what was that? Oh, I dropped that. Y'all, I dropped, I had a top sitting on my car. Drove off with it on my car. It's gone now. What I tell you, it's been crazy. It's been crazy. Oh my God, we had to do an intervention at Christian school because Christian barricaded himself in the fifth grade classroom and just went and had a whole like psychotic episode. Like he yelled and cursed at the teacher. He was doing all this craziness. And then when they tried to get him to calm down, he would not calm down. It was so bad they were going to call for, um, uh, I forgot what it's called, but it's where the police come in the mental health evaluators come and we were going to have to take him to a mental hospital and all that because he ha was having a manic episode really bad and it was i've never seen christian that way ever so yeah we were at the school for about 40 minutes or so getting him to calm down get out of the episode so no one additional had to be called and then by the time we got home and everybody started to calm down because he lost all his privileges yesterday for the way he acted in that classroom. Then we got home and middle of the night, Grace begins to get sick. Grace is throwing up. Grace is pooping. Grace's stomach is jacked up. So Grace is with my mom right now. I just got done. That's why I was in the Dollar Tree getting stuff clean in my car because she pooped in my car this morning. Yeah, she threw up and she was just at the doorway of the car and came out the back, all right? So she had an appointment at 5.15. It was earlier. They rescheduled it to 5.15. Um, and then I'm just praying it's not COVID because like if it's COVID, then what? You know, but um, I think she just has some kind of stomach bug. She was able to keep down breakfast, thank God. And she's been fine since then. Only thing is that she's soiling her pants. So I have to go and get her some Depends that way she can she has an accident I can easily change her but I am fully cleaning my house gutting my house right now of things spraying everything down my mom's helping me I gotta go get more laundry detergent so that'll help out with the cause like when I tell you it's been crazy like if you don't hear from me no more today and you only see me stopping at these stores it's because it's crazy Justin forgot his glasses so I'm about to go run his glasses up to him after I put this um 
giveaway mail in the mail because I said I was going to send it today and I stay by my word. I stick beside it. I stick beside it. So I'm about to go do that. But y'all, when I tell you it's been local, like, oh my God, yo, it's been crazy. Like, oh, I didn't expect the week to like turn up like the week has been turning up and i'm like turn down turn down like don't turn up like this so y'all it's been crazy but i'm gonna go ahead and send this okay make sure this closed right price now off check my p.o box um see if we got anything in the p.o box go to um uh, H-E-B so I can get more laundry detergent so my mom can start some more loads for me and get Justin a drink from the H-E-B because he's going to need that drink for school and drop off his glasses. I'm over here looking for his glasses. They was in my purse. Okay, here they are. I'm like, boy, how you forget your glasses? Look. Boy, forget his head if it wasn't on his shoulders, okay? And I don't know how he kind of bent them. And look how dirty he got these glasses. I'm going to clean them before I take them into him because I have some cleaning. Um, uh, so, yeah. Yeah. But anyway, I'm done talking to y'all. I'll be right back. about to start reading actually came today yay i told y'all i was going to i'm just on the floor um but it's called the last mona lisa y'all this is over 300 something pages what am i getting myself into 376 pages uh to read but oh my goodness i, I haven't read <laughs> this much in a while um but it says the past and present collide in this tale of art thief art theft forgery and murder exploring the secrets of the 1911 theft of the mona lisa so yeah this is supposed to be off the chain so i'm excited i'm excited i'm, I'm excited i'm excited and it's based on a true story so that is super cool so it starts august 21st 1911 paris france I'll keep you guys up. Come to find out from the doctor is a stomach bug going around. And what happened was Grace went to school and I guess someone sent their kid to school that had the stomach bug instead of keeping them home. And Grace catched the stomach bug, well, caught it, and then she brought it home. Grace was tested for COVID. There is no COVID in her. She's COVID negative. So it is a stomach bug. That's the problem. And she actually passed it to the entire family. So we all had the stomach bug. So we'll keep you updated. Um, everyone's doing a lot better. So I want to thank you guys for watching and we'll see you in the next one.